hey guys welcome back to another video oh my gosh guys it's been a week since i last uploaded a video <laughs> that is crazy but i'm back with the banging look new hair finally got my nails it's been like three months since i got acrylic and i finally got them done and you can see i'm ready for the spring and the hair i'm not even gonna touch the hair it looks amazing did it myself like what and it's a wig it's a fucking wig like you're gonna see that it's a wig <laughs> but anyways guys i hope that you guys will enjoy this very beautiful green um mermaid it's giving me like mermaid vibes like i am in love with this fucking look i hope that you guys will enjoy this tutorial and if you do give it a big thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to my channel click the subscribe button join the family turn on the bell notification and let's just get right into this look guys so i'm gonna start off by priming my lid with the concealer and i'm using the maybelline fit me in the shade 35 i think it's 35 and i'm just gonna use my brush to blend it on my lid and i'm not gonna be setting it then I'm going to go in with this yellow shade and this yellow is not really that pigmented so I'm going to go ham and pick it right um uh right on this area above my crease going towards my brow bone. Because today I am going to be doing like a wing the outer cut crease so I want to make sure that I am like pulling it towards the outer area of my eye. Okay guys, so I forgot to press the record button, but like I'm using this green from the Uranus eyeshadow palette and I am just placing it on my uh, crease area and just blending it out. And you can use whatever motion of blending that works for you. Just make sure that you are blending it thoroughly. I use a lighter shade of green to blend the edges of that darker green and I'm just going back and forth between those greens so that I blend and make sure that everything is perfect or it is transitioning smoothly into that yellow. And whenever you feel like um, the other green shades have taken over the eye look, just go back to that yellow and pack it. Make sure that it is there, it is showing up because it was invited to the party. I can never get like my wing cut crease to look the same. Like one of them has to turn out a little bit wonky and I'm liking this one. And this one is turn is, yeah, it's something else. I'm going to set this concealer with some translucent powder so that it's easier to apply the shimmers on that uh, cut crease area because these shimmers you don't really need a white surface for them to like pop the first shimmer we're going to use is this gold one and i'm placing it right on the inner corner so right next to it i am placing this moss green shimmer don't forget to blend out where they meet because you don't want it to be a harsh line next to that green on the outer lid i'm gonna place this blue shade oh my gosh this blue shimmer is amazing what and the pigmentation is oh gosh okay guys so for my under eyes i'm gonna take the darker shade of green that i use on my crease and i'm gonna place it right close to my waterline And I'm going to blend out that darker green with the yellow that I used. And I'm going to take a brown pencil and I'm going to put it on my waterline. In the corner, I am taking this beautiful green shimmer and I'm just going to like put it there and let it shine and do its thing. Guys, look at that. Then I'm going to use a little bit of it right there on the edge of my brow bone. Just plug it there so that it shines and gives it a little bit of a lift. Mm -hmm. 